Hello and welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can record all of your golf statistics down to the T. It's really simple, it's free, and it's so, so accurate. Anyway, so let's get started. What you want to do is go to Google, type in golf performance analysis, scroll down to the first one where it says spreadsheet library. I'm going to click that. Then you want to go scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page and then click where it says download golf performance analysis. You're going to click that, it will pop up here in a little download and then should only take a couple of seconds. Once that's finished downloading, click it, you will be redirected to an Excel page and bear in mind you do need Microsoft Excel to use this. So if you haven't got Excel, you won't be able to use it. And it will give you this screen here. All this is telling you about is just how to use it, basically. Again, with a second page, instructions on what to do with the page and what not to delete and what to keep, etc., etc. It's very simple. This is crucial. This is what you need to do. And it's probably the most important part of the process. You're going to pick your favourite course or the course that you remember at the or the course that you play the most. This is how you're going to keep track of all of your data. So then you're going to choose the white tees, you're going to type in all the information of the white tees, off, just get your scorecard from your uh, pro shop and it, just copy it. You're going to do the white tee, the yellow tee and the red tee. That simple. Then, once that is done, that is pretty much it. This is just an example. You'll be able to go up here where it says competition, type in your competition, whether it was just a medal or just a knockabout with your mates. You're going to pick the T. This person's picked white. Round, keep that on. Date, if you want to try the date, by all means do that, same with the start time and finish time if you want to know what time you was playing that day. You don't need to do it, but if you want to, by all means. You need to type in your handicap. So you'll type in your handicap and your playing handicap. That's all you need to do for that top part. Then, on this bit, this is the bit, these in between these red lines, all you need to do is type in the score you got, the amount of puts, and if you hit the fairway. If you hit a fairway, you just put a one. Two puts, three for the score, etc. You do that for all of the front nine, all the back nine, filling in the data. That is it. It is that simple. Once you've filled all that in, it will do all the calculations for you. It will tell you if you hit the green in regulation, whether you hit the fairway, if you got up and down, did you make the up and down? It's Honestly, it's amazing. It's the best bit of kit for free, already done there. Then you can see on this scorecard, if you hit a fairway, the percentage, the greens and regulations, puts, up and downs, what holes you made, what score it was on the par three, the four and the five. It's awesome. And then you'll be given graphs. You'll have a graph of all the breakdown of the scoring average. You'll have graphs of putting, fairways, greens and regulation, all but done into graphs for you to make it easier to see. And then you, hear, uh, you can click down here on average. It'll show you your lowest handicap, highest handicap. This is all done just from putting those three things in on that scorecard. It is honestly amazing. Down here, you'll have a little scroller and you'll be able to scroll across and look at percentages and other things. It's so, so detailed. And then your total. It'll show, after a couple of rounds, let's say four rounds, it'll show you what you are over them four rounds. You'll be able to see what holes you're struggling on, how many puts you've had on those holes, whether you've hit fairways on that hole more regular than another one. or It's just really, really good. And it's down here where you put the... Um, Scorecards. So all these are basically your different scorecards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All the way, I think it goes up to 150, and then after that, I think you can make more. 
it's amazing. So literally, you like you do that for your first day, da 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 da, type it all in. Next day it comes, we move around, do two, three, four, etc., etc., and then over time, on your average, your total and your graphs, you'll have all this information. You'll be able to see where you need to improve and where you're going bad. It's amazing. Honestly, guys, get it downloaded. Tell me what you think in the uh, comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and if you do download it and or have downloaded it, let me know. I want to know who does it and what you think of it. So yeah, nice and easy for you. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you all subscribe and new content coming every single week. Bye for now.